My name is uh, Hibin Abu Hassan. Uh, this is my uh, my son Marwan Abu Hassan. He's 11 years old and uh, he's in uh, grade six. Uh, we are from Syria. My name is Emeka Osan and this is my daughter, Amaka Emeka Osan. My name is uh, Edward Nusakari Odaro. My name is Wagbai Agbanisala Odaro. His favorite color is blue. Yes, yeah, she's right. Uh, my mom's favorite color is black. Yes, you're right. Because this color is elegant. And your mother, she's an elegant one. <laughs> my dad is a drilling engineer and he works in the oil and gas industry. My mom currently studies philosophy. My dad owns a business about cars and generators. He's rich <laughs> and he's a loving dad. Well, that's her impression, so I can't query that. I would have to say that I love the way my mom is very caring. She is truthful and she's always honest about things. I love him. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Whenever he meets someone and he sees that they need help, he's very willing to give them that help. Parenting these days is a full-time job. Kids are not on autopilot at any time. You have to be in their lives all the time. And then you have to juxtapose that with your own, uh, you know, schedules of life. So it's, it's not easy, but it's fun. And if you didn't have the grounding, you know, proper grounding, proper discipline when you were growing up, you probably would um, stand the chance of being misled, you know. So I would say the strict upbringing, yeah, was good. They weren't uh, strict or lenient. They are in between. And I had a memorable uh, childhood upbringing. If I'm to answer that question right now, I would say my parents were lenient. But if I was to answer this question when I was at age, I would say they were a bit strict. And also, you need to know what kind of friends they have. What are they learning from their friends? They should engage in this discussion with their kids. They will be able to learn and advise their kids. That's my, my advice to parents today. The smartphone um, opens the world entirely you know, to kids. Like some of the things my children tell me today that they have seen on the internet, you know, even though we control their use of the internet and we also restrict the sites they go to. But the things they're able to do, you know, with a smartphone, I am married. There are some things I don't even know about the smartphone that they already know. So I'm imagining when they get to my age, how much more would they know, you know? Marwan, he's very uh, honest boy and uh, he's very uh, intelligent boy and he's very uh, loving boy. Thank you. <laughs> um, like my son, for example, he does a whole lot on the system, you know, being able to create programs. And I give kudos to the school too, because um, coding and all that was learned from here. And then he spends a lot of time exercising by himself online. Uh, I was forced to actually confess to him uh, some days ago, I said, you marvel me. I'm very proud of you. At least for some things now, you know much more than I know. You know, because daddy used to be known as all knowing. Anything they want to know, they come to daddy. But now they're becoming independent. They go on the system. They find out things for themselves. Uh, my son does things that I could never have imagined. I can't even disturb my head between these days. So I would say the smartphone. She's very caring. She's very reliable. She's very sincere. I love the fact that um, apart from being an all-rounder in, um, in her academics, she's also showing the penchant for the love for the arts, which is what I do, which is what I earn a living from. You know, so I'm, I'm happy about that. You know. And she's also a very loving child. Um, my favorite daughter, you know, uh, the way she wants up to be, you know, is something that I've looked forward to in my life. I, I see it happen with her, and I'm happy about that. Happy Global Parents Day. <laughs> happy Global Parents Day. Thank you very much. Happy Global Parents Day. Thank you, my darling. <laughs> I love you. My name is Adedo Israel, principal of the elementary school, Grainville School. Parenting is such an interesting, and challenging experience 
but it still remains one of the most rewarding experience anyone can wish for. So on Global Parents Day, I'm here to wish all Grenville parents and all parents out there happy Global Parents Day. Keep enjoying and doing your best as parents for the upbringing of your children. Thank you.